Can you see this clearly with the naked eye? Believe it or not, 285 million of the people on this planet have trouble seeing this image. And nearly 39 million cannot see it at all. Throughout human history, we have tried to correct our blurry perceptions of the world. From the earliest spectacles invented by the Romans more than 2,000 years ago, to Leonardo da Vinci's Codex of the Eye in the 1500s that introduced the idea of contact lenses. Both glasses and contact lenses went through enormous innovations in the 19th and 20th centuries, and for most of us, that's what having corrected vision means. Glasses, or contact lenses, or glasses, or contact lenses, or glasses, or contact lenses. In the late 1980s, LASIK eye surgery changed that equation for many who were nearsighted, farsighted, or had astigmatism. But for millions of people today, these solutions are simply not enough. That was the case for Alan Pineda Lindo Jr., also known as Apple D. App, of the world-famous hip-hop group, the Black Eyed Peas. He suffers from a rare eye disorder called nystagmus, a constant involuntary eye movement, or dancing eyes, as well as severe myopia, or nearsightedness, that has rendered him legally blind. He was told by many doctors that there was nothing he could do. He spoke with ABC's Good Morning America in 2012 about his condition. Up on stage, what can you see? About like the first five rows. What can you see of the other guys on stage with you? Pretty much like the whole body shape, but I, couldn't, I can't see like facial details. Apple D App has performed in packed stadiums all over the world, but could barely see anything beyond the stage. But thanks to Dr. Brian and the Boxer Walkler Vision Institute, Apple D App was finally given hope an innovative eye surgery called Vizian ICL that would finally do the job conventional glasses and contact lenses could not. Good Morning America followed Dr. Brian as he performed Apple surgery in front of their cameras. Glasses is a real big problem for Apple because the glasses are stationary yet his eyes are moving. With this lens now inside his eye, when his eyes move, now the lenses move with it. The operation lasts about 40 minutes, as one at a time, Dr. Boxer Wachler inserts the lenses okay, so this is the lens. into the eyes of Apple the app. So now we're actually inserting the lens. Who's awake throughout. It's a little fuzzy, but is that how it's supposed to be? That's normal, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he leaves the operating room and immediately hugs his joyful mother. How does the world look to you now? <laughs> Great, man. It wasn't as scary as I thought. It was, uh, I just felt a little pressure in my eye, and uh, it was easy. As the moments pass in the doctor's office, he's startled by the changes. The fuzziness is already going away. One week later, in the recording studio, Apple the app is eager to report all the exciting new things he can see. I could see almost 100 feet away, and before I couldn't, I couldn't see that. The doctor says it's only going to get better because, you know, I'm still getting used to the lenses inside my eyes, so it's definitely a, a great success. But you don't have to be a famous rock star to find hope. In fact, even though Dr. Brian has been featured on numerous television shows as the eye doctor to the stars, the vast majority of his patients are neither rich nor famous. And his innovative eye procedures can help not only with patients suffering from nystagmus, but many more common eye conditions that might cause other doctors to say there is no hope to ever see clearly again. One of the most treacherous eye diseases that plagues millions of people worldwide is called keratoconus. Keratoconus weakens the cornea, the outer lens of the eye, resulting in it becoming misshapen and often causing glare and halos at night, double vision, and triple images. Problems far beyond the ability of conventional glasses or contact lenses to correct. 
But with Dr. Brian's innovative treatments, there is real hope to preserve vision and stop progressive vision loss caused by keratoconus. And while special glasses and contact lenses can reduce the symptoms of distortion, multiple images, and streaking for a brief time, it has only been within the last decade that the latest science and technology in the hands of innovative surgeons like Dr. Boxer Walkler has given sufferers of keratoconus hope to not only get their vision back, but to get their lives back, making the world they see clearer and sharper than it has ever been before. Cornea collagen crosslinking is a traditional procedure that uses a special riboflavin solution along with surgical removal of a layer of the cornea to treat keratoconus. In 2003, Dr. Bryan developed the very first non-invasive, non-surgical corneal crosslinking treatment that does not require removal of a corneal layer and is a 30-minute pain-free outpatient procedure that halts the effects of keratoconus. Called the Holcomb C3R crosslinking system, it has the longest track record of any form of crosslinking procedure in the country. Holcomb C3R saved the vision of American bobsledder Stephen Holcomb, the procedure's namesake, who was told by other doctors that nothing could be done to stop his vision from deteriorating except a cornea transplant. But after undergoing Dr. Bryan's Holcomb C3R procedure and receiving lens implants, his vision vastly improved. And he went on to win the gold medal in the 2010 Olympic Games in Vancouver and two bronze medals in the 2014 Olympic Games in Sochi, Russia. A common companion to the Holcomb C3R procedure is Intax. Clear, thin prescription inserts placed underneath the cornea to reshape it and improve vision. In Dr. Bryan's expert hands, Intax is a typically painless seven-minute procedure. In 1999, Dr. Bryan was the first surgeon in the country to perform this procedure and has successfully helped thousands of patients from all over the world who believed they would never have clear vision again. Far too many doctors don't even present intacts as an option for their patients, resorting to the much more invasive cornea transplant surgery. CK is a seven minute innovative procedure that uses radio frequency energy to reduce astigmatism and greatly improve eyesight. When combined with Holcomb C3R, it can improve eyesight for many years to come. And these are just a few of the vision-saving procedures and treatments offered by Dr. Brian and the Boxer Walkler Vision Institute that has put them at the forefront of eye care and saved thousands of people around the world from the threat of keratoconus, the worry of cornea transplant, and the devastation of losing their vision. So even if you don't want to be a rock star or a world-class athlete, and you've been told your vision will never improve or will only get worse, and nothing can be done to improve how you see the world around you, don't give up hope. Ask Dr. Brian.